In business news, China and Nigeria will stand together, seeking mutual development and continuously write new chapters of practical cooperation. These were the words of China Council General in Lagos at the 15th edition of China Commodities Expo Nigeria 2023, which held in Lagos. Our correspondent, Paul George, reports. This expo event has the president and representatives of the Chambers of Commerce and Industries from Southwest and the North. They have come to see new technologies and also look at how Nigeria can continue to consolidate on the gains of Nigeria-China bilateral trade. Lagos State Governor Babajide Sonwolu, who was represented by the Commissioner for Commerce, Industry and Investment, Falashade Ambrose Medem, says Nigeria is working with China to ensure ease of doing business. The Consul General in Lagos, Yang Yekin, is confident that the relationship of China and Nigeria will be beneficiary to both countries. Forming strategic partnerships and ensuring that we have a very robust export policy is very important. And that is something that we're working on through the Ministry of Commerce, Cooperative Trade and Investment, which sits under my mandate as the Honorable Serving Commissioner. So that is a policy that we're looking at, ensuring that the ease of business agenda in terms of the parameters are also being clear and understood. Those are very important and most importantly as well is ensuring that we're having the right strategic partnerships and collaborations with the Chinese government as well. Nigeria is uh, our largest uh, manufacturer uh, market. Uh, so today I'm so glad that uh, more than 200 uh, uh, Chinese enterprises uh, uh, participate in uh, this uh, expo. I'm confident uh, that uh, our China-Nigeria uh, relationship, especially um, our uh, commercial uh, cooperation, will uh, have a very good uh, future. The president of Bochi State Chamber of Commerce, Industry, Mines and Agriculture, Honorable Aminu Dam Maliki, lauds the Chinese government for the giant strides. His counterpart from Ikurudu, engineer Olukoyede Shoderu, represented by the former deputy president of Ikurudu Chamber of Commerce, Tele Oduloye, says the presence of China is a testament that we have to use modern technology for development. When the Chinese decided to come to the world stage, they planned and organized themselves in a big way. They hit the world stage miraculously in a peaceful manner, which poses a new challenge and new opportunities to the whole world. I hereby say, a big congratulation to China and the Chinese people for achieving this monumental accomplishment. These efforts are bearing tangible results and have laid the foundation for a credible path to development, growth, sustainability of bilateral trade and cooperation. Presence here is a testament to the tremendous opportunity we have to use modern technology as a game changer for economic development of our great country. And uh, this time we have organized over 150 enterprises and uh, over 200 booths. Commodity covers uh, uh, heavy industry and machinery uh, food and food processing uh, uh, machinery and uh, transportation and uh, logistic uh, machinery. We are producing machines that used to blend NPK, that is fertilizer NPK. So we have different kinds of machines here, starting with the uh, small scale that produces uh, 3 tons per hour. We have one that produces 40 tons per hour. And we have a soluble ones there that produces 20 tons per hour. And the most interesting thing is that these machines are low power consuming. The Consul General, Yinkin, hopes the Chinese business community at present will, with sincerity and enthusiasm, make more friends in Nigeria. Paul George, Plus TV News. Hello. 
Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.